Hi everyone. So we have got my Advent candle lit. We're ready to go on that. Just trying gonna try to shorten it today. Really gonna try my best. So mini vlogmas number four. I've got my wine pulled. I've got my coffee out. My truffles ready to go from Quilty Mom Trish and Alex. And I'm gonna try to do my Ipsy glam bag regular from November. So anyway, I hope that you keep watching and we will get right into this. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy. Welcome back to my channel for mini vlogmas number four. So of course I have to have another ugly sweater on. So I pulled this one out of the closet from last year. So I got my snowman here. It's got some glittery snowflakes. We've got a pocket here with a sleigh that's got a Santa in it. Just a regular plaid sweater, just a re regular every ordinary day sweater, right? But I thought it needed some bling, so I had to put on my earrings from Vino. So anyway, let's get into this right away. The coffee, and I'm going to do a taste test later on this because this one looks so, so good. This one is from the donut shop again, and it's red velvet latte. So I'm excited to try that one. We've got a Pinot Noir from Gerard Wineries in California. This is 2020. It's 12 percent so like I said we've got it open I got my glass we are just gonna whip along try to save some time alrighty so let's well I always struggle where to put it turn it around again just a little bit of wine because I'm going to be enjoying that coffee after this looks really pretty nice it is kind of see-through it's a nice purpley red smells fruity mm. we have a sip cheers everyone happy vlogmas mm. so this one it's it's a nice light tasting wine again i don't know if all these wines that i've had like the last four days that i've had from qvc are just really light tasting wines and not strong at all because maybe maybe i, I do have some taste in things from from covid left over but i can still taste it but it is just very light it's very mild it is dry so when you take a sip you can feel the tannins just kind of dry the top of your palate out when, once you go to swallow it it's when you get that burst of flavor so this cranberry <coughs> sorry about that cranberries raspberry some cherry mm. and a little bit of oak from being in the barrel so that sounds really good to me. I am going to enjoy that later. I think I've got some cheese and crackers. I'm going to have a little snack after. And I'll, I dropped my card. I have to get my card. So this is the card that came with the November. My, just the Ipsy Glam Bag Regular. And I think everybody probably pretty much knows about Ipsy, but I'll have it uh, linked below in case it is something you want to try. This is just the glam bag. It's uh, usually comes with five deluxe samples. Every now and then you do get a full-size item. Used to be $12. The value is supposed to be at least $50. And now it's gone up to $13 unless you signed up to get it for a year. They do give you a brief description of everything that's in here. And it looks like everything here is a deluxe sample. All right, so it comes in this really pretty little green velvet bag. It's got Ipsy engraved on the little pull tab. It's like a pretty kind of like a purpley burgundy inside. All right, so this first item is from Origins. And this is a frothy face wash. So enough for a nice little travel size. Get a few washes out of that. So a deluxe sample of that. Next we have H2O. Plus this is a gel moisturizer. And just in case some of these um, end up in this uh, little gift bag over here. I'm not going to open anything and show it. This is a primer from unicorn glow 
long wearing primer. And this tiny little bottle here is so stinking cute. If I had a little dollhouse, it would be perfect in there. So this is a face serum. I'm not sure if it's going to focus a more Pacific Youth Revolution Radiance Concentrate. So a magical face serum. And the last item is this another cute little tiny thing. It's a deluxe sample of mascara. I probably have it upside down. So it's extra sculpt volume mascara from Ditto or Dido. All right. So again, we've got this little green bag here. Mascara, magic serum, primer, face wash, and a gel moisturizer. All righty. So I'm going to go grab my coffee and I will be right back. All righty. So I am back with my red velvet cake latte coffee for my vlogmas day number four for my Keurig. I'm not sure if you can see the color, but it is, it's pink. It's pinky. So I floated a little bit of whipped cream on top. Of course it melted by the time I made it back down to the bedroom. Yeah, walking still a little bit of a hassle for me. So anyway, cheers everyone. I'm gonna have my coffee. Oh, it smells so good. Oh my gosh, this is delicious. I hope they sell this as a single. Um, it's like red velvet cake. It's like you get like that chocolate, white chocolate, but you still got the coffee flavor. You got like a cream cheese in there. It is heavenly. Donut shop, red velvet latte. So good. Mm. But I'm going to have one of my truffles. And you see, I, I did only take two. I mean, I tell you, I was tempted last night after I had that pink one. Oh my gosh, it was so good. Um, I'm going to go with this one with the, uh, all these kind of little chopped little nuts on them. Alrighty, and again, these are from Quilty Mom, Trish, and her son, Alex. Just such a really nice person. Give you the shirt off her back. Just really nice sweetheart. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So, so good nice soft chocolate I've got some nuts on there like a peanut butter brickle or something like that mm, goes so good for my coffee it actually starts melting the chocolate that's left in there but you know just for the sake of testing I'm gonna have a little little bit of wine so good but I think I like it with the coffee better yeah that's one of my favorite coffees so anyway thank you guys for stopping in and sharing mini vlogmas with me I hope you guys all go out have a great weekend and we will chat again tomorrow love you guys bye bye